Hello everybody, this is our Santa Training 25 room escape room map. It's time to train up and be the best Santa that we can be. Let's go ahead and start things off if you would, Callie. Okay. And the elves have set up a training course for Santa to make sure he's in tip-top shape. So you just have to escape every single room. And we're going to show you how just in case it's too tough. But remember... Half the fun is in trying, so, you know, give it a shot first, and if you can't get through, jump to that spot in the video and let us give you some pointers and then move along. So, we have three doors. Unlock the door. And up, oh, there we go. There we go, and finally a way out. So there we are. And now we're in a room <laughs> full of things that you can walk through, but only one of them actually works. And it's that one in the corner. There we go. All right, this one's pretty clear cut. Obviously, we're gonna parkour up onto the shelf, and there we go. And we have the magic. What? Saw something there. <laughs> we have the magic fireplace you can walk through, and right here we have what looks like a chimney. So let's just jump in. And it is a chimney. You have to practice dropping down chimneys quickly, though. Because, you know, Sam has got to move fast. Okay, not quite that. Okay, that was a little too quick. Let's try it again. We have a check checkpoint here for a yep. reason. Yep. <laughs> right there. And if you look up real quick, Kelly. Oh, boy. That's why you got to move quickly. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh, not quick enough. <laughs> All right, and moving right along, we're going to try again this time. I feel it. This is going to be the one right here. Absolutely. Zero damage. Perfect run. Too much pressure. I'm not jinxing Kelly. Okay, oh, you already... Boy. Okay, that's not... Okay, well, that... Um, so, some oh, damage. Wow. Mostly perfect. Okay, not really... Okay. <laughs> Definitely made it further than we have yet, so I'm going to call that a success. <laughs> All right. Here we go again, and... Okay, I'm going to do it. Yep, I know you will. Alright. I'm not good at this stuff, though. Neither am I. I don't even know why I put this in here. <laughs> I literally, Ow. at one oh. point, while, while oh, testing... Oh, no. <laughs> at one point while testing this, I literally said, I hate this. It's perfect. <laughs> No, I wanted to do a dropper, but you know, something a little bit different, something kind of Santa themed, so the idea is maybe. Oh! I hate to see it. <laughs> but, Kelly is showing off, or will soon be showing off, one of the features of this particular dropper. I'm sure I'll get there. Yep. We're, we're not quite there yet, but uh, now there you go. And all the way, and. There and cross, and then in the corner, or okay, yep, there we are. And against the oh, we did it. Slide off of those. Oh, 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 no. oh, 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 it is possible to do a no damage run. I've never actually done it, but I've done it in segments, so I know that it technically can happen. <laughs> but, um, I think I did it once, maybe. Maybe. maybe I was, maybe I was dreaming. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> wasn't this? Nope. This was not the time. All right, so we're getting close, though, I think. Oh, boy. Oh, not yet. Okay. Okay. There I we got this. go. You can do it. I have faith in you. You don't have to jump back up there. But I like to. I know, but that just makes that, the damage zone closer. That just okay. makes me feel better. Okay. Oh. And that log did not feel better. I just, I ha I hate that I have to uh, go move so fast because of the damage. Yeah. I mean, here's the thing. Kelly's demonstrating. Oh, look at that. Okay, Santa, we can see you're having a little trouble with the chimney course. We've made it a little easier given your advanced age. Gee, thanks. I think some elves are going to be seeing a dock in their pay. But, yep, that turns off the damage barrier so you can take your time and plan your moves. And I like taking my time. Yeah, definitely. All right, so... So I can jump up here. Because you can just slide to that one instead of jumping. But, but I don't... I like jumping. Okay, fine. But, uh, Wait, yep, there we go. Yep, there we go. Perfect. And oh, and then I missed it. 
There goes our perfect run, but it's okay. We're still gonna know. Oh, maybe not. Oh no. That's all right. <laughs> we will get through it. Eventually. Okay, I got this. It's okay, it's okay. You're you're okay. You can do it. You got this. Okay, don't. No, yeah, there, there. Don't slide off. And five, four, three, two. Yes, I put that in there on purpose. One, there it is. We did it. Excellent work, Kelly. Oh, it only took me several tries. And right here, so many things with which to play, but three of them should go away. So what three things would we get rid of? I mean, we don't want gas in the toy room. You know, I can think of some uses, but... <laughs> there we go. Fishing poles, probably a no. Also probably a bad idea. You know, barbed hooks, not so great in the playroom. And coral, because coral. <laughs> Crouch when the kids are looking. If you look, there's a faint blue haze. That is telling you when the kids are looking. And if you aren't crouching, Callie. Oh. Oh, you didn't. You didn't <laughs> crouch. Soon oh, there enough. we go. Oh, there we go. <laughs> you have to start over. So that's it. You just. Oh. Nope. Okay, we showed them already. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure I'll show them yeah, again. Probably. That's okay. But yep. Yeah, so you have to make it through the entire course, but. You can only crouch while the kids are watching, or they'll catch you, and you gotta start over. And there we go. Be careful of the books right here. Yes. Some dastardly person put them on there, and oh. stepping on a book will raise you just high enough to guess what? You're going back to start. There we go, and. I'm being cautious. One. Okay, run, run, run! <laughs> Got it, there we go. Alright, so, these two bears are staring at us. That's not weird or anything. Oh, well, you didn't show them why. The bears are looking that way because if you're not looking that way when you go through the door, you're going to start that room over again. It's going to throw you it'll, back over there. It'll teleport you through there in infinite loop until you walk through backwards. Now we have an unlit Christmas tree. What is the deal with that? Oh, we got all these switches here, so let's see. Okay, so that one turned a couple, and that's a couple more. Okay, so far so good. Oh, wait, nope, that one turned off, and then that, okay, now more of them. No, seriously, Callie, come on. <laughs> supposed to be lighting the Christmas tree, not unlighting it. No, oh, you had it, okay. <laughs> Number, nope, 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 okay. <laughs> well, you turned them all off. Well. <laughs> okay. Go ahead and push the reset button. All right, the secret is one, two, three, four, five, one. And that turns all of them on, lights the star up at the top, opens the door. You missed the llama, but that's okay. There's actually two. Yeah. Okay. Sweet but twisted. Collect three. No, we're not talking about Cali. Hey! We're talking about candy canes. That's right. There's one, there's two, and there's three. There we go. All right, so we have a whole mess of bears who are staring at you, and that's not <laughs> creepy at all. <laughs> Get out of this room quickly, please. <laughs> okay, you're going to have to count all the bears, but we don't want those little misfit bears, even though they're adorable. We yep. just want... The regular bears, and if you count all of them, there's 21 of them. The misfit toys will not help you out. <laughs> Get it? Help you out? <laughs> anyway, 21, and then hit the miss. Yep, and there you go. That takes you out and into the door maze, which is literally just a whole bunch of doors. There's, like, so many doors. And there we go. Kelly gets through it every time. It takes me a little bit longer. And we are running up some. Okay. <laughs> 
Let's just, okay, run up the stairs. Nope, well, you, you gotta get the milk and cookies. You can't forget the milk and cookies. That's right, so grab your milk and cookies, and there you go. You can go all the way up. Um, and invisible. Yeah. Hopefully they fix that soon. Or magic fair. Yeah, no, the couches, <laughs> some of the couches are invisible right now, but there's not really a good way to fix them because you can't remove them, so they'll be invisible for now. <laughs> Alright, nothing there. Oh, there we go. Oh, God. Be a duck. Yep, trust us, be a duck. Because <laughs> it's the only thing that is small enough to fit through that teeny tiny gap in the ceiling right there. And there we go. Alright, so let's open our present. It's a harpoon gun! Who doesn't want a harpoon gun to catch coal? Listen, it seemed like a good idea when I thought of it, okay? Alright, just kidding. So you're going to be harvesting coal right here because you've got some people on the naughty list coming up and you need some coal to load their stuff in. So, go ahead and keep on harvesting. And this will have gotten the proper amount. We're not quite there yet, but we're close. And there we go. All right, so that takes us through, and we've got stocking. So let's just go put that coal in the. Oh nope, there's a barrier. You can't get through. You can throw them all day long and probably drive yourself crazy, or you can just go up top like that. And drop them in that way. One, two, and three. And that opens the way through and the door to get out. And you're in this room, so we would sit down and watch a little TV, but this couch is also. <laughs> we'll just go in here. Yeah, we'll just get on out of here. No couches, so. <laughs> and no invisible couches in this room. Just a clock. That I keep up in too. Yeah. That, there we oh, go. Man, that was actually pretty quick. <laughs> All right. Nice little bit of music kind of makes you want to dance, right? Dance for two. Yeah. Or sing. Oh, okay. Yeah, we can sing. Singing works. And singing literally works because it gets us out of there. And to the present parkour. Oh, I hate this part. Oh. I want to point out that Callie designed this. Callie came up with the idea. I had Callie help. designed it. <laughs> you. You told me to put the... I suggested snowflakes. snowflakes. <laughs> I didn't even place them. I merely <laughs> suggested them. And then cool super bear that I was in. Yep. So. I only bring that up because, yeah, you know, Kelly hates this probably more than anything else. Don't try to jump to that one. I forget every time and I regret it. Yep, there you go. Hop. Uh, this next one, you want to kind of jump behind the snowflake a little bit. There you go. And then... Oh, boy. Okay. This is going to take a while. Insert sad trombone. No. I did it. There we go. That's it. Don't walk off. Make sure you jump. <laughs> oh, uh, but yep, yeah, there's a checkpoint. So when you're done, you don't have to go back through that. So let's see what the next room at. We're slidey, and there's a timer, and there's another invisible couch. You have to have um, presents all over the place. And our four-year-old help. Yep. By I'm help. Blind him. Yeah. And there we go. You got to get to the end. You got to hit that button. And now there's a bunch of note blocks, so this should be easy. Just play a song, right? Uh, no, oh, wait, okay, there we go. Yep, yep, yep. Keep moving. That's the one. Oh, is it? Yeah, it is. Ah! Oh, too late. <laughs> That's what happens if you hit a wrong note. You get to play it again. It's a little bit 
hard to hear for us because we have the volume down. No, that one. There we go. And straight on. Yep, there it is. All the way out. And now we have a silenced pistol. So, we have five things that are not where they should be. Like, and that's fair. The thing is not in the right spot. Out of order. This bear is wearing a shirt, and that one is hot. We got our pile of toys right here. And last and but not least. Yep, and that's it. Alright, so. What's that mean? Well, the music must be over here by the piano, right? So, let's start dancing, or singing again, because that works too. And now it's snowing indoors. All right, and time's up. There we go. And the door opens on its own. I just love it when that happens. You left the All party. Right. You left yeah, me. I got tired. <laughs> I was grabbing a stand very quick. Well, here we go. We got to get out, but that fire is roaring, and we are never going to make it out of here with a burning fire. I don't even know how we got in here with the fire burning. <laughs> so we're going to get a bucket, and we need to find some water. Okay, there's some water. Oh, bucket has a hole. All right, we gotta fix it with something. So, drawer maybe. Uh, okay, a hammer. That works definitely. But who knows how to fix a bucket? Why would Santa even know that? Well, there's a book. Okay, there we go. Got a book on how to fix buckets with a hammer. Perfect. So let's get us some water. And let's go see. And the fire is out due to the water bucket. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. All 25 rooms done in record time by Callie Bell. Grab that coin and give yourself a GG. Alright guys, so we hope that you have fun with this map. We had a lot of fun making it and testing it and tweaking it and coming up with ideas for Did the rooms. we really though? We did. We absolutely <laughs> did. Uh-huh. Now that we're done, yeah, okay. we had a lot of fun doing it. <laughs> Might have said something different otherwise. But no, it, it was a blast. We hope you guys have fun with it. Um, it's a great little map. And again, make sure you get a screenshot while you're doing it for today's entry for the contest. And get that hashtag on there. And just uh, keep coming back to the Frosty Hills Advent Calendar. And happy holidays, everybody. Bye. Bye.